And we're going to have to take the long way around for this one to push it down the hole. So that does it. So instead of taking the ladder, I'm just going to fall the hole. Instead, it's quicker. And there are a few items to get in some of the corners. Yeah, this cul de sac is obviously concealing something, and it's a car, folks. And by the way, cul de sac is a French expression which literally translates into ass of bag. I'm not making that up, folks. And I don't even want to know why it's called a cul de sac when it means ass of bag. I don't even want to know. And speaking of bags and asses, here we got uh, another wild deli bird. It's carrying a bag and it's complete ass, so it's only appropriate. So what do we got there? It's a max potion. So I think we got all the items in the corner, so now it's time to figure out that puzzle. And nope. Went sailed straight past that one. So here we go. I'm going to go in that direction instead, and I think I'm onto something. No! So how am I supposed to deal with this? The solution's gotta be easy. There are only so many things you can do. Oh, come on. Think, think! Okay, think! Oh yeah, now I got it. I was supposed to go clockwise. I went counterclockwise the first time. So here we got a full heal. By the way, this dungeon looks really cool. Oh jeez. I don't have my pseudo Udo with me. Hopefully there is another way around this. And I think there is if I look at those stairs. And yep, there is still hope. I don't need my pseudo Udo for this one. Thank you very much. Never melt ice. I am very happy with my uh, Mystic Waters that I got on Suicune and Lapras, though I might be interested in uh, giving this to Lapras eventually, since it's got Ice Beam, which is Stab, and on top of that it's a lot more accurate than uh, Suicune's Blizzard, so yeah, if I want to use it, it's going to be on Lapras and nothing else. So I guess we're going to head closer to the exit, since we, we were starting to head back up instead of going down, down, down. So this isn't a very convincing puzzle, thank you very much. On a completely unrelated note, something that hasn't got to do anything with Pokemon at all, uh, well, I read that apparently the chief operating officer of Blizzard became a minority owner of the, of the Pittsburgh Steelers, and Diablo3.net titled the news as More Proof That World of Warcraft Makes Too Much Money. I think that title fails if you ask me. Okay, there is an item there. How am I gonna get to it? I think I... Oh yeah, that's the easy way out. Nope! Doesn't work. So, I thought I, I, thought I was gonna be able to cheat this the system here, but no. Okay. I, oh, I got it! I gotta take the, 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 the jump here into this and there. Okay. And it's rest, so that solves the problem of Suicune's moveset, so now I'm gonna teach it sleep, talk, and rest right away, and yes, I checked it in this generation, sleep, when sleep talk, chooses rest, it refills your HP instead of failing, but the drawback is that the, the sleep counter resets, so you still gotta sleep three more turns, but that doesn't mean anything when, when you can just keep attacking and replenishing your HP, you, you just... Um, have no control over what you're doing. So yeah, I think that title failed. If they wanted to to make a lot of sensually sensi sensationalism with the uh, with that title, I think they would have said World of Warcraft buys the Pittsburgh Steelers. So how do I get back to, to the ladder? Well, I think nope, not this way. I have to take the long way around and then slide all the way back to the ladder right here. Here we go. So, oh god, no, not another puzzle. Well, at least getting to the item is easy this time, but it's just an iron. It's not waterfall or rest. Boring! At least it's gonna come in handy when I get Lugia eventually. So, how am I gonna solve this? Oh yeah, here we go. 
That wasn't hard once you stopped to take a look. Okay, a protein, and I think we are at the exit of the ice cave. Sad. I really like the way the, the place looks, despite it having all those ice puzzles and everything. But I guess it can't be helped. Even the coolest parts of the game have to end eventually so we can move on. Can't stay here eternally. Especially not when there are zoo bats and go bats flying all over the place and trying to kill me and failing miserably. So yeah, we're heading to Blackthorn and the, I checked the map and there are very few buildings. The only thing of note is the gym. Well, and the move the leader as well. This is the first generation where there's a move the leader, by the way. Really should have been in red, blue, and yellow because it really sucked having absolutely no way to get rid of your HM moves on some of your Pokemon. Blackthorn City, a quiet mountain retreat. Well, quiet is right. There aren't very many people there. I think the three quarters of the population are in the gym. And they have to put up with the most aggravating of all the 32 currently known gym leaders on top of that. So, yeah, I couldn't do that trade, obviously, haven't got a Dragonair, and if I had one, I don't think I'd be trading it for a Dodrio, I'm sorry. So, yeah, I wanted to talk about, uh, you know, the things that your mom buys when you leave uh, her some money after each battle. In Hard Gold and Soul Silver, it's been radically improved in the way that, well, most of uh, the items that she buys are type-resisting berries, but some other times you get really cool items. You got, for example, I think there's one of the choice items in here. There's no junk to put into your room or, any, or anything like that. Sarah B even says, sadly, there is no room decoration options. You call that sadly? I can at least get some worthwhile items instead of, you know, all kinds of shitty dolls that won't help me in those tough battles. Well, as tough as it gets in Pokemon game anyway, but as I've heard, they really cranked up the difficulty in Hard Gold and Soul Silver compared to this game. So they are because they raised the, the, the levels of the Kanto gym leaders, and on top of that, well, apparently Red is not a pushover anymore besides the levels. By the way, this is the first Pokemon that sells Ultra Balls in the entire game, and I don't need them anymore because because I already caught everything I needed to with Great Balls. For Larvitar, it's gonna come in a ball already when I buy it. Lugia Heavy Balls, who Master Ball. That's the current plan. So I don't have any use for those Ultra Balls now. So now I'm going to let Psyduck forget Surf and put Waterfall in its place. I'm just gonna have to have either Lapras or Suicune stapled onto my party for my surfing needs. Not that it's a major inconvenience because those two kick ass. But yeah, as I said, Red's Pikachu now has Vault Tackle and a Light Ball, so you, you're gonna have to deal with it accordingly, and, well, the, his three starters have the Elemental Hyper Beams. Now I know those are sucky moves, but they can still be hard to deal with, especially if they knock out your designated counter for some reason. And yes, it's the same as dealing with uh, the Alga's Roar of Time, but they still can kick your ass if you're unprepared. And we are having to deal with basic item descriptions this late in the game. What next? Berries automatically restore 10 HP? Hey, Bill hates milk and can't drink it. Well, I'm not terribly fond of milk either. I get all my calcium from stuff like yogurt and cheese, and you get the idea. But seriously, what, what do I gain from knowing that about Bill? What, what's gonna be next? Bill wipes his ass front to back? Yeah, lots of legends about dragons in this town, and we already heard one from Lance in Red, Blue, and Yellow. Remember when he said dragons are virtually indestructible? Well, that's a legend, all right, because no way that is true. Not after the ass-kicking I gave him and his sorry team of dragons. Okay, so guess I'm going to have to take care of his cousin soon enough, but not now. I'm going to do Route 45 and the Dark Cave segment that comes with it first. Then I'm going to take care of the gym.